Hello everyone and welcome back for some more Brynhilda the Vampire Valkyrie. And we suddenly just got a lot of income, so we're just gonna start spending a bunch of it. And first of all, I'm gonna want some men at arms, specifically wolves, because not only is it super thematic and just awesome to have a horde of wolves just leading the charge, but we also don't have any pursuit units, so these guys are gonna be great to just run down their fleeing units. So we're just gonna grab these and just fill it up to the max. And that is a lot of our money, but I also want some mangonels, because right now we're kind of terrible at sieging. So we're gonna grab some of those and just get a couple of them. Because I don't want to just fill them up all the way, because I uh, kind of can't afford that. Because we still have other things I want to get. And one of those things is just improving our court, really. Because I kind of just want to put everything to the middle, and I don't want to go too deep in our income. So, we're just gonna do that. That is uh, a lot more money, but it is gonna give us some nice bonuses. I would like to go all the way up, but that's gonna be really expensive. That's gonna be three extra, which uh, I don't really think we can afford that, so we're just gonna be happy with this and just get our court grandeur. It's gonna be good for us. And I also wanted to just go through and have a look at these. Because I'm pretty sure that we lost our stable person. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Because she got captured. So let's just appoint you, get our knight effectiveness better, and get our court grandeur back. Let's see, is there anyone else I want? I was gonna check some primogen as well, but man, this song is going hard as well. But, do we have any good Simiche? I mean, we have an okay one. That is some natural dread. But is that worth 8? Because it's not like we have a lot of... Uh, a lot of Simiche anyway, so I'm gonna think about that. An event true? Just a poor one. So, and what is the value of a poor event true? And do we have any good court seers? No, just average. Because that would have been pretty good, just get terrified taxes. Because if we pick you, yeah, we don't even get any of the terrified taxes uh, bonuses. So I guess that's gonna be have to be good enough, unless we have some fun of these. I mean, we could just host Elysium or survey capital or some stuff like that. But I don't think we're gonna do that right now. We can work off some stress, which we are gonna do. And, ooh, this is not enough, I think to myself, as I put down the training sword, I've been practicing non-stop, but I'm not getting tired. I need tougher challenges. Yes, something bigger, or perhaps heavier. Something sure to tire me out. Oh, are we gonna just lift the Statue of Ignorance? Because I don't think we're... I don't think we care if this breaks, because we only get a little bit of court grandeur. And it's just gonna lower the the durability a little bit anyway. <laughs> I'm not gonna spend that much money. So yeah, let's do this. We're gonna get some good exercise. Which, I mean, it's not gonna be insane, but we get a lot of stress loss, which is why we're doing this. I guess we <laughs> can wound ourselves, but we got blood heal, so it's fine. So yeah, let's uh, do the Statue of Ignorance. And, uh, yeah, that's not too bad. 15 endurance or 15 durability and we lose a lot of stress. We are feeding, right? Uh, drain animal. Yeah, we are feeding, but I guess we can try to hunt a little bit. Can we do it? I guess nothing seems to have happened, so I guess not. That's fine. And wolf is doing fine. It's just threatening stuff. Ooh, we can make you a shield maiden. Oh, you're unlanded. You actually came over. So yeah, make you a shield maiden. That is fine. Anyone else? No? Okay. We can ransom some prisoners. Oh, they're actually gonna pay real well. Let's uh, let's do that. Oh, we should have blood bonded. Dang it. Ah oh, well, I don't think it matters. And I guess we also have a lot of duchies we can create. So let's... Uh, let's start with... 
Oh, that is just okay. So we don't care about the um, we don't care about VSP, but we can do small on that is a lot of counties, and we do not hold the capital there. Which one is that? Um, okay, you know what? Which county is this? Or which duchy? Duchy of Estietland. Oh, we already have that one. And which one is this? Guess we can... Nah, you know what? I don't think we need to. Because I think we're holding duchies on all the things we're doing. So I just... Let's just go to war instead. Let's go and fight Skåne. Because, uh, oh, they're allied to Duke Hardestad. He has really fallen. Oh, damn, he's strong, though. He is pretty damn strong. We might need our allies for that one. We can call them. We're making so much prestige each month. So I guess we could just... Oh, right. Actually, something I meant to do a long time last episode was we can could make another accolade, which we were going to do. And you are actually really strong, so let's do you. You can be contender, which doesn't mean anything. And that doesn't really mean anything. So let's change. Okay, you're actually kind of terrible. Let's not do you. Let's do you in... Well, you don't really like me. Oh, because you're the, you're the wrong thing. Oh, and you're already... already thinking about something so I guess uh, let's uh, let her think a little bit she became a shield maiden now she likes us pretty well she will not accept oh because she's zealous okay so let's not grab her don't want uh, wrong religious things how about you oh you're my ghoul are you pregnant? No. You're doing a terrible job. But what can you be? You can also be a contender and a marauder. I do like marauder because that's going to give us some advantage. Oh, you can be a bunch of things. Level reinforcements is pretty good. Charmer seduce power. And courtiers are slightly more vulnerable to seduce. And skirmishers. Okay, that's pretty good. What are you? You are... Oh, you're an animal. I guess uh, animal is their own thing. You should be the same as well. You are... Spearmen. And you're archers, but... Hmm. Okay, so we don't have any skirmishers, but it's still a good one. And I guess we can get some skirmishers. That would be light footmen, right? Yeah. Which are fine. They're mostly filler. But it was still pretty good, right? Because we also got... Oh, that's just skirmisher damage. It is movement speed in provinces affected by winter, which is pretty nice. And it lets us have huge skirmish, uh, skirmish uh, regiments. Oh, we can... Not retinue skirmishers require primary. Oh, so if we, yeah, if, okay, if we set you here, we can get some specials. Oh, those are pretty good, actually. Yeah, let's select you. And I do still like marauders, but I do think I like disciplinarian more. Let's get more levies and stuff. Let's go with that and create that accolade. Great. So, do you bring your own stuff or do we get them here? Okay, we don't get them here, so I guess he brings his own. Maybe. Unless they just haven't upgraded. Or updated. But, we are embracing Berger Jarl. And we unlocked a melancholic lifestyle. Cool. So, he'll figure it out. He's a smart dude. So, have you updated? Okay, so I guess... Uh, I guess he just brings them. That's pretty good. That is actually really good. So, Melancholic. We have Fortitude. 
So let's just grab a little bit of prowess. And we're getting there with the animalism, I suppose. But yeah, we were gonna attack Skåne. So let's declare on this. Uh, no. Hollow War of Duchy. That is absolutely fine. And this time I'm not gonna make the the mistake of uh, underestimating my enemies and just bring more stuff. But, oh, you're actually getting kind of strong. Good. So let's just bring all of them. We are fighting how to start, which uh, I was hoping to just uh, kill. Oh, wait, we can vassalize someone. Where was that? I saw someone want to vassalize. You. Okay. Yeah, vassalize, yeah. You're not under attack, so that's fine. There we go. So, raise everybody here. We're still gonna bring or get rid of a couple of uh, levies because we don't need like insane amounts. But we're gonna get a couple. Oh, don't, don't disembark. Don't be an idiot. You can just walk through here. Everything should have plenty of uh, of supplies, so it's fine. Let's get that away, and let's get that away. So, let's just muster. Muster, muster, muster. An education. Schemer child. Your new child loves the cloak and dagger ambience of vampire politics. He has already outwitted some other neonates and shown a serious talent for intrigue. You could pu uh, push him more towards honing these skills on his own, or you could use the help of, uh, for some pressing schemes that you're currently planning. Well, I guess we'll make you very good at intrigue as well, which I guess it's just a theme with my kids, but man, you are excellent. We should give you a duchy or something, because you're gonna be great. So, okay, everything is... Oh, you're trying to take Erland. Well, that's interesting. So, let's just uh, get rid of some of those, because I don't want to be too too deep in the red. And we have a lot of troops. And let's get rid of, like, one more. That's going to put us reasonably, and we're going to lose stuff anyway, so... Let them land and just go and squash them. So far, your child has followed, you, followed your faith mostly because you said so. Obviously, though, he is far from understanding the inner workings of the beast and how to deal with it. You will have to take some time to start this part of the teaching or hire some learned practitioner of the road to help your progeny along. Eh, just pay for it. It's fine. And you are just gonna be slaughtered. Tempted by hedonism. Your child has taken well to his new condition, perhaps a bit too well. Very Jarl spends his time partying with mortals or even other vampires in a quite depraved fashion. Obviously, you would prefer him doing useful things with his immortality, but convincing him might be, be an arduous task at this point. No, I don't want him to be of the wrong faith, because faith is just half the campaign at this point. So we're just going to go with this stress. We're, we're final stress. And yeah, we are just tearing those apart. You can start sieging. No, you can start sieging. And let's put uh, you in there. And you do, you do not seem like the right person to lead that, but I guess we don't have a choice. Wait, who's leading the other ones? Wait, what? Okay, where are I guess uh, the other people are just busy doing other things. So you go and siege there. Uh, you go and siege there. And the presentation. Behave yourself in there. Oh, and you need to go and siege that, let's say. There we go. And now we're getting some vassals coming in to help. Excellent. Ooh. During your child's first introduction to court, a small number of your vassals arrive with a generous gift for your progeny, not for you. They are obviously trying to cre create a rift between you by making your claim... You claim the gift for yourself. A not so subtle plot, but still enticing by its sheer volume. So, you're currently unlanded anyway. You got a lot of claims though. You got a claim on Midgard. 
So what we can do is just take this money, run with it, and start swaying you. There we go. That's gonna be fine. Don't have to... Don't have to worry about you because you don't have any troops. And the end. Good. So, I guess we're just... Uh, we're just uh, sieging all of Skåne at once. A commoner of Swedish heritage has been accosted in the streets of Helsingland over some minor offense. By making a statement in their offense, I could perhaps convince my son Birger Jarl, the equally Swedish of my good character. The equally Swedish of my good character, but I might risk alienating my Norse peers. Ooh, what we could do. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I can spend a little bit of prestige. I prefer not to, but that's fine. Oh, they went over there. Well, that's all right. But what I was thinking is... Uh, how's our culture? Can we... We're pretty high acceptance. Can we not... We can't diverge. Why can't we... Why can't we do the the hybrid? Oh, you cannot form a hybrid culture with a culture that is derived from... Oh, how about Norwegian? No, I guess all of them is derived from me. Not, not Sami. But do I care about Sami? Because they are... They're kind of behind us in innovations. I wonder if we can do Danish? No. Because they all just deride from me. That's super annoying. Okay, then just uh, keep sieging and just keep going. This is fine. I think this war is gonna be over quick, but I want Hardestat to get over here. I wanna kill Hardestat. That was the whole point in bringing all of these people in. So we're gonna just keep it going and just kill these guys. And I think we're just gonna send some troops down to Hardestat. There he lives, so let's see if we can just go down there. Oh, we can sail through most of this. That's pretty neat. Pretty nifty, if I say so myself. A snake at court. I'm... Heading for my chambers to enjoy some blessed sleep w when I hear a faint rustle from a window. Just a wind, I think. Until the wind starts speaking. Hold. Open up, my little firebrand. It is I, Yalmar. I push the shutters open and lo and behold, a man has climbed up hold up to Holt's window. It is my vassal pack member, Yalmar. Okay. Uh, do I care? I don't think I do. But let's see if we can just uh, if we can just uh, kill Hardestat here, because I would. Oh what? Ah, oh, they they gave up. Boo! I want I wanted to kill Hardestat. Oh yes, merge and it's bad. Fine. Oh. We got some raiders here. Race local. Go and kill these raiders. I won't have them in my lands. Inspiration realized. Yay, our statue is done. My lady, my beneficiary Edith, gestures me over to an object covered in fabric with a wide grin on her face. I have toiled many days and nights and finally my work is done. She whips the covering off and my eyes gr uh, grow wide as I see what's hidden beneath. A beautiful statue of High Valkyrie Brunhilde, painted and finely carved. The High Valkyrie is famous for her unparalleled skill in battle. The oak of the sculpture is finely worked. Ah, uh, it's oak. I was hoping it was some kind of metal or stone. But I guess this is fine. That's a, lo a nice amount of prestige for a statue. So, it is lovely, I suppose. And why can't we do... Why can't we do your your inspiration? I want to I want to do your inspiration. 
And there's no way of doing it from here. Which is dumb. Okay, whatever. What happened? Why did the thing... Oh, because we had stress. Right, that's fine. Kill those guys, we got loot recovered. Excellent. And I guess we can hold a grand tour if we want to, but I think we're good. Alright, we need to give this all away. Oh, there's... No, those aren't special buildings. Those are just normal buildings. So, Lund is probably the capital, and it is. And I think I might want this. This is really high development. And I'm okay being, like, one above. And how many duchies do we hold? And that, we can look that here. Okay, we have two duchies already. So we're gonna keep that for us. We are... Well, I still wanna... I still want you to be a powerful vassal. Why aren't you a powerful vassal yet, you stupid child? I mean, you have some levels. Oh, but you're not powerful anymore. Hooray! We definitely have some better here. Okay. Um, I suppose we can pop you in there. No, wait. You want to do stuff. So let's... I think you're pretty good at other stuff. Okay, you're an alright intrigue person. But not really. Because I do want you on my on my thing. But you're only good at at being a marshal, really. So I guess I guess we don't need to have the greatest uh, spy master. So let's pop you over there. Let's see. Swap you. We're gonna overall go down in points here. But that's gonna be fine. Because we get some nice bonuses from these people being on the council. Oh, but you're you're terrible. Could pop you in there. Oh, but he he is a pretty good steward. These guys can actually switch. They would actually benefit a lot from switching. So, swap that. We actually go up on both of those. Should have done that ages ago. And uh, I guess it doesn't matter who we have here then, because the last person is uh, garbage and he has a stupid name. So, let's just uh, put you in there again. You can go back on the council. And everyone is super happy. Very good. But we still need to give these guys away, so so let's just give it to. Kind of want to just give it to. Let's give you some more land. So I would very much like you to be a powerful vessel. I guess we can give our new son some land as well, especially since we've been swaying him. He should be pretty happy. So, grand titles, let's give you Halland. Let's give you Blekinge. Yeah, that's fine. And new child, there you are. You're gonna be super happy. Oh, you're not at our court even. Well, I guess uh, invite you to court. There we go. And gr grant you Bornholm. There we go. And we are going to have to get our control going here in Skåne. That should be alright. You're still working on that. And we're gonna have to to uh, convert this, but we're starting to look a lot like Sweden and a little bit of Finland. Very good. And those are lots of dead troops. How did the wolves do? They didn't actually kill that many. I guess that makes sense, because this is actually a stack wipe, so no one really killed a lot. And 
the wolves killed a lot more than uh, than their power is. So they did a great job chasing there. Excellent. So we are probably spending, well, actually not that much because everything is mostly reinforced. So nine gold per turn. I guess, uh, I guess we can start increasing that a little bit because we do have the money. And actually just top it off, I suppose. That's going to be a lot of sieging and it's going to be great. And I don't really... Oh, more neighbors can be vassalized. Nice. Okay, so they're just letting us have Finland, I guess. So how much of Finland did we get there? Oh, wait, was it somewhere here? Because the... No, wait. Oh, we got these guys. That was one of our allies. Okay. And we got a court event. So... Oh, no, right. We have an artifact put out. Actually, a bunch of artifacts. We have Tale of the Crone, which is gonna give us some monthly learning experience, which I didn't even know we had. So that's good. We also have some furniture. We already have the Statue of Ignorance, so let's pop in the Norse statue. Still don't know why we can't make the other inspiration, but yeah, let's... I suppose we're gonna do that as well. It's not a lot of lifestyle experience, but it's something. I'm not gonna turn it down. And there, now we got a nice and big name, which is arguably one of the most important things in these games. The biggest name is the best name. So, more vassals. And we are, oh, right, we are having a little bit of stress problem, so maybe we should stop feeding on animals for a little bit. Uh, as our order of the slain grows, we need more land which to organize our defense of the Ein... Einherjar faith. Okay, let's stop that first. And Barony of Hafre. Who lives there? You. Well, you're not terrible, but you are not my vassal, so I don't care. Especially since it's Bimbi. I hate Bimbi. So, granted. Does that does that maybe take away his uh, powerful vassal status? No. But I guess someone else became a powerful vassal. Which is our chaplain, which is very annoying. Just fixed all of that. But I guess you are pretty good, so... I suppose we should pop Bimbi in there. Stupid Bimbi, I hate you. But there you go. You best start being happy. But that's gonna be a pretty good court chaplain, so that's good at least. And he's gonna be done in two months, so we're just gonna speed on through. Oh, who created a faction? Bidier Jarl. Oh, you, you bastard. How dare you? Well, we are. We are. Uh, um, swaying him. And it's not like he doesn't seem to have any friends. No one... Oh, no. Oh, there's... Oh, there's... There's people joining. Hmm. Why are you there? I thought you liked me, you bastard. Oh, well. Still not very strong. And uh, pretty sure we can deal with this, no problem. So, we're just gonna ignore that. And we have a mental break. You're nothing but a loathsome snake. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that doesn't matter. Our, uh, our champion is just gonna be yelled at a little bit, but you can get a spouse. So how about we just grab someone with very good prowess? Like this guy. Yeah, bring him on in. Love to have some gargoyles up in here. He can be... Oh, right, we need to do this. Uh, just cuss her out, that's fine. And we got a gargoyle. Nice. So you should be a... You should be a champion. Shouldn't need to do anything, right? Is that our court? Oh, yeah, there it is. Now he's a champion. I guess uh, I expected him to get a helmet or something, but that doesn't make any sense. So we're just gonna 
keep on going. And how long until this truce? We should check that. Yeah, 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 people are marginalized. We have a lot of troops. And our truce is 13 months. So we can take Lapland pretty soon. I guess we can just start fighting you if we want to. Eh, let's uh, let that truce run out. A killer in our midst. The smell hits me before the door op is opened. A heavy and meaty odor that permeates the area. It is the stench of a newly dead. Yet another body has been found. They have all been people of little importance, thank beast. But the court is getting nervous. I will scour the castle for this murder. Or let's bury the body and forget this travesty. I mean, we do need to lose some stress. But I want to do some Sherlock Holmes in here and solve this, this murder. So for now, oh, we can't work off some stress yet. But I guess we're just gonna lash out in that case. So cast this guy out. It's fine. Now we're good on stress. I don't think it's a good idea to start drinking animals yet. But that is fine. And we can still do some of these. Is there anyone I want to fight? Oh, right. Oh, but that is if we lose. I don't want to fight someone too strong because I don't want to lose. Yeah, that's the problem with these, that they're all super strong. They're fucking werewolves. We're gonna have to fight one of these eventually. Just because it's fun. Yeah, you, you aren't transformed, so you're gonna be super strong. Actually, what is our prowess now? We're actually 66. We can probably do one of these. Let's just find someone who's... Uh, not that bad. We don't have to just seek out the strongest one on purpose. Yeah, let's go with this guy. So far, he has been the weakest. Oh, wait, no. That's not what I meant. Oh, I just unselected it right away. Uh, so we can do it for money. Some weak hook. I don't think care about weak hook. And I don't think we care about his stress. So do it for money. It's fine. And let's do this. I arrive in the de designated spot near Solatumum in good time and find pack member Odder is already waiting for me along with a small entourage of witnesses. Whatever else he may be, Odder is fit to fight and willing to risk meeting me man to woman. I'm a little bit disappointed it didn't feel like he needed to be in his uh, werewolf shape, but oh well. The formalities are brief. We all know why we're here and we're long past the point of talking. Weapons are handed out and our retinue start retreating to observe from a safe distance. May the best woman win. Ho ho ho. Okay, there he goes. Now he's in the Krenos form. Now things are interesting. For a few brief moments, pack member Odder and I pace in lazy half circles, each watching for an opening. I heft my Wayland Wurken, ready to defend myself, while he clutches his sword firmly to hand. Uh, this fight may only be till first blood, but that doesn't ease my nerves. Why does he have a leaf there? Is that just a huge cock? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, with a sudden twitch, our bout begins. My opponent locks my leg in one place. Oh, that's not a good start. But we can show him how a professional fight. You have to let your guard down eventually. I am an animal! Now nah, let's uh, let's show uh, show our professionalism. Oh, I guess we gain stress from that. That's fine. I'm fine with it. With practice ease, I evade a strike from Order, stepping into the blow, stepping into the blow, and bringing my sword up for a powerful cleave before darting back out of safe distance. My opponents attempt to destabilize me by taunting my character. My form is excellent, with little chance for mistake, and Order's stance is failing. We are evenly matched with victory balancing on a knife's edge. That's not what the previous sentence said. Um, not gonna showboat because this isn't actually... Oh, but I guess... Oh, that is actually... That's not showboating. <laughs> I thought this was a trait or something. But no, this is... Uh, this is giving us dueling edge, but that's fine. This is pretty good, though. 
Yes, bring out my claws. Yeah, let's bring the claws. Fucking fight this beast to beast. My claws are outreached, ready to cleave my opponent in half. My opponent suddenly jumps at me, attempting to impale me with his claws. My form is excellent, with little chance of mistake and other stats is passable. I have my opponent on the back foot, but I still need to consolidate my victory. So, let's just... Just keep animal at him. <laughs> I am an animal! I use my animal form to jump at my opponent, fangs first. My opponent locks my leg in one place. My form is excellent with little chance of uh, mistake and other stance is a disaster. My opponent is reeling from me. Victory is so close that I can practically taste it. Yeah, rip his throat out. Yeah, there we go. My claws are out outstretched, ready to clean my opponent in half. And it almost happens as my opponent barely managed to avoid a certain fatal swipe coming out their way. Uh, I should have killed him. I should have killed him, but that's all right. Victory trial by combat. Resting easy back in Norale. I ex exult in my success, my sword laid across my lap, the satisfying ache and pains rippling across my body to remind me of a small moment in of small moments in the bout. Little victories and fierce fought defeats, each winding towards pack member others loss. A sack of, sack of silver rests against my skin, the satisfying weight of a testament to justice well served. I had each coin counted, the one one by one, in front of everyone before we rode home. Yesterday we put our, our quarrel before before Beast, and Beast answered wisely. Justice is served. There we go. It's not like we could have imprisoned him anyway. And how is our... Oh, still 11 months. I guess I didn't let much time pass. So we're just gonna let some time pass. Enjoy the music and uh, my Ein Einherjar family. I raise my hand to call for Snorri Sturluson from across the hall, yet my son only returns an embarrassed glance before rushing off. My own family has been turned against me by that vile bastard chaplain Bimbi. Oh, you fuck. He has taken up a habit of whispering lies in my relatives' ears whenever they got they they go to him for spiritual guidance, claiming that I am a wicked uh, a wicked high Valkyrie and that beast cursed our house. Well then, why are you such a miserable cur? Well, you still love me, so that's fine. With a public show of of contrition, help. Spend some uh, prestige, which we kind of want our prestige. Every pious I uh, family member of mine loses an opinion of me. That's not great. And everyone else also. Okay. I will not let a court chaplain undermine me. Yeah, I think that's fine. Get some dread. Show who's boss. We got plenty of piety. So, yeah, we're just gonna do that. And can we do something here? Like, can we... Uh, when two gangrel meet each other for the first time or after an extended absence, they perform a right status, sparring or boasting their feats to know each... Okay, no. I kind of wanted to blood bond you. Oh, are we not in the same place? Okay, I guess uh, raise local army, pop us in there, and just uh, get everyone out there. We're just gonna go with all of our, or some of our champions. Okay, I didn't mean to get that many. Go with some of our armies, just right up there, show a force. Ow, oh, can't because he's landed. Oh, that's some bullshit. I hate that. We could dehabberize him, but that's not gonna work. Prison. He yeah, might succeed, but that would be dumb. How about murder? Nah. Okay, I guess we're just gonna have to leave him be. Boo. Not a fan of that. So let's keep letting some time pass. Oh, we are still... No, wait, that is herd feeding. We're not drinking from animals, right? I stopped that. 
Yeah. Negotiate alliance with... Well, first of all, end your stupid... Uh, stupid faction and we'll talk, but... Nah. Don't need it. Oh, Marshall and Princess Vassal. Neat. And we are 45 days away. Nice. Oh, someone wants to talk in the court. I wait patiently for my throne, on my throne for the arrival of pack member Thordis, who is soon announced and ushered before me. Okay, grab some prestige, very good. And there is the thing. Murdered successor, oh! Our successor was murdered, okay. I mean, she is my daughter, but I mean, I didn't sire her in this game, so don't think I care that much. I stare down at the lifeless body of my daughter pack member Adisa and feel dizzy. Surely it is my blood that is coating the floor beneath her, for none of it is reaching my brain. I crouch beside her, cupping a cold cheek on my hand. Her eyes are wide open, but in surprise rather than horror. Did someone you know do this to you? I mean, I would like to know who who dares touch one of my family members. Make it known throughout the realm that I'm looking for information and clues. I mean, if someone comes forward, I would reward that heavily or dearly. <laughs> I don't know what you would like. Handsomely, I think would be the way to call that. Yeah, I reward that handsomely. Oh, we can steal artifacts. Oh, that's a cool one. We'll start that scheme. And let's start declaring war here. Let's take Lapland. De declare war and let's grab... I guess local army. That's just five, just 5,000 levies. And I think that's probably good enough. Let's raise all of those. And were you allied to anyone? You were, right. These guys who surprised us last time. So let's uh, let's call you. That might be enough. Because we can probably take both of them on our own. But it would be nice to have some backup. Oh, right. Of course. That's okay. We can start... Although that's probably gonna... That is probably gonna... Oh, we can actually start it right away. Good. I thought it was gonna be like... A, a ended murder scheme or something that we would have to wait a while. And you shouldn't lead. You're terrible at it. You shall lead. I shall lead. And you shall lead. There we go. Three armies. Go and siege. And I guess these guys might be able to just take them out. Oh, never mind. Here comes the reinforcements. Okay, they're just gonna start not sieging down there. Where are you going? Oh, they're gonna siege over there? Well, we're gonna finish these sieges. And then we are gonna go and just bop these guys. We should be all right here, but you should slow down. Murder it. Stop murdering people. Jesus. Uh, a curious man has searched me out after hearing about murder murders plaguing my court. I am Freyr, my, my lady. I think I can be of help to you. Oh, it's someone who knows something. Beautiful. So, I can use all the help I can get. I need to find the murderer of my children. So, send him in there, and we are golden. Beautiful. Oh, they actually finished the siege. That is super annoying. And that wasn't even a lot of war score. Well, grab one of you. Go over there. Let's... No, dang it. Grab one of you and go over there. And just start sieging over there. Because now we're just gonna carpet siege this in. Oh, I thought they were going to try to go and kill us, but that would be... That would have been suicide. No. Oh, wait. No, you finished. And you finished. 
So I guess all of you just go and gather over there and we'll go and kill these guys again. Uh, you don't need to end that siege. Okay, thank you. He realized in good time. So that's good. This war should end real fast. Let's just get some supplies with you. Because we are taking a lot of attrition. Murders at court. Murder in the morning. Another one. As the sun rises, I am greeted by the news that Fides, Fides? A commoner was murdered during the night, brutally gutted and laid out to be seen by whoever walked past. The body is quickly removed, and by the time the sun sets, no trace of the grisly act can be found. Huh. Okay. That is... Wait, he was the st Oh, he was the gargoyle. He was the stone angel. God damn it. Make sure everyone is accounted, uh, accounted for at all times. I will f find this murderer. And actually, what are we at? We can only get six more, so... And that seems to be happening over there. Because... Uh, no, wait, we're losing that. Murders at court. A confrontation. A letter is waiting for me and Freyr as we me and Freyr as we retire to my chambers, written in red ink. No, in blood. For the sake of the kingdom, you will stop this search. I have lived my whole life right under your nose, and still you are so blind. To uncover my identity would only bring you pain. This handwriting is almost it almost looks like that of my daughter and her and heir Maria. Could it be I thought she died. I guess that was someone else. Could it be? Murders at court. Dark legacy. When I finally track my daughter and heir Maria down, she does not even try to run from me and the guards. Hello, Brunhilde, she says, looking me up and down. It is about time you found me. I take it you enjoyed my gifts. The smile that spreads over her face sends a shiver down my spine. I mean, you are pretty. Uh, you are a pretty good fighter. We could use you, <laughs> but you will be punished for your cri uh, crimes. We will imprison her. An eye for an eye, a life for a life. Now let's uh, let's imprison her. We. Oh shit! Get over there. And. Uh, actually, let's just go and set everything over. Okay, not everything. Let's uh, station some besiegers. And then we're going to bop these guys. There we go. Easily kill those. And that should be it. There we go. So, we have a lot of stuff happening here. But um, I'm going to end this episode here. We're going to give these away in between episodes, I think. But the rest of this long line of things we're gonna do at the start of the next episode. So thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye!